like show business, like no business I know. This is beautiful Burbank. From the shops of Magnolia Park to the trails in the hills to our diverse neighborhoods, Burbank's got something for everyone. People love us for our small town feel, but they know us for our impact on the entertainment industry. From the back room of Benny's Beanery and Firework Factory in beautiful downtown Burbank. After all, we are the media capital of the world. Just look at who calls Burbank home. Disney, Nickelodeon, Cartoon Network, Hasbro, Netflix, and Warner Brothers. Well, welcome back. There's a nice way to say that, Karen. And did I mention, I am lucky enough to be the mayor of this amazing town again. Right now, I am sitting in one of my favorite Burbank restaurants, the Smokehouse, where Oscar nominated film La La Land was shot. It's another day of sun. Burbank turns Hollywood dreams into reality. You could say we're the town behind the tinsel. And I bet you didn't know that one of the most famous people on the planet is actually from right here. No, I mean really famous. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Folks, this is really exciting. We're in the animation offices where they get together and they work on SpongeBob. With me right now is Carson Smith. Carson, is SpongeBob from Burbank? You know, Bob, I couldn't say. You're gonna have to ask him yourself. What? Hello? SpongeBob? No, this is Patrick. SpongeBob? No, this is Patrick. Can I talk to SpongeBob? No, this is Patrick! <laughs> My bad, wrong phone. I'll get it, Gary. Hello, SpongeBob's house, SpongeBob speaking. Hey, Spongebob, this is Bob Frutos, one of your biggest fans, the mayor of the city of Burbank. You got a second? What you up to? Hey, I'm here at Nickelodeon. That's really fascinating. Carson told me you're going to let me know, and the people of Burbank want to know, are you from Burbank? Sheesh, what a chatterbox. Can't he see that I'm busy? I lost the signal. I'll never know. Well, Bob, there's one secret we can share with you. Come with me. Okay, Carson, what's the big secret? Hit me with it. Okay, that was really different. Yeah, now we're talking, yeah, ow! You know, not everything in Burbank is made by media giants. There are also hundreds of small production companies that create exciting content. For example, Apartment D is a local studio that specializes in stop motion animation. What is stop motion? I'll show you. How cool is this? Apartment D even managed to take a few inches off my waistline. I'm looking good. <laughs> Apartment D is a stop motion studio here in Burbank. We specialize in high action stop motion animation. Uh, we work a lot with kids brands in particular. Mm -hmm. Character and narrative are really important to us. High action, um, high personality. Hey Courtney, That's me. What you doing? Stop motion is different from any other form of animation in that it actually physically exists in the real world. So we work with our hands, we work with a lot of really talented, gifted artists to craft things 
physically. You build your characters and sets in real life, and you move them a little bit, and then you take a picture. Then you move them, and you take a picture. It's like sculpting one frame at a time. And with the laser blaster, she'll find the tool she's after. She's brave and bold and weak. Yeah, I think it's cool that we've gotten to work on such a wide array of things. Nickelodeon has been a really important partner for us, and recently we've been working with them on uh, one of their new shows, Middlemost Post. Warner Brothers has been another big one. They're stage 13. We've worked on um, a series called Family Style with them, which is kind of like an uh, food and travel Double. series about uh, the role of food in Asian culture. Yeah, we, we've even gotten to work on feature films. We worked on the credit sequence for a film called Shazam a couple years ago, uh, which was an amazing sequence because we produced feature quality work in a garage. So Apartmenties always existed in Burbank. We, we started uh, in an apartment that was right by Alameda and Victory. We moved into a house that was Buena Vista and Glen Oaks, and now we're at Victory and Burbank Boulevard. You know, there was something very real about trying to start an animation company in your apartment that you can see Cartoon Network from. You know, we would walk to the local diner and pass Nickelodeon. And I, you know, there's that feeling of like walking in the footsteps of giants. Like it felt like if it's gonna happen, it's gonna happen here. And talent wise, everybody comes to Burbank to animate. So all the animators we need, all of our like extended networks and everybody there is part of that industry. And we all came here to be part of that industry. So it's just the perfect place for any animation minded artist. Apartment D might have taken inches off my waistline, but the barbecue from Handy Market is putting it right back on. Handy Market is not only a favorite neighborhood market with some of the best barbecue around, it is also one of the ultimate caterers to our film crews, and our residents often line up to get their carnivore fix. Hi, my name's Alan Arzoyan, and I'm the owner of Handy Market. And I'm Mark Arzoyan. I'm obviously Alan's son, and uh, together we run the Handy Market. I feel blessed that we're in Burbank. I mean, Burbank is a fabulous city to be in. And being in Mag Park, it's, it's a great location in the city where there's tons of small businesses and people that support local small businesses is important to the city and, and we need more shops like that. Our catering business is probably 90% studio related. Being in, in the media capital of the world, we have every studio right here and Hollywood over the hill. So it was just a natural thing to grow that side of the business. Currently, right, right now, we're probably doing I would say uh, 15 TV shows and two features. Location scouts started popping in um, and they asked if we'd be interested in using the store for filming. And yeah, I mean, obviously we were. And we've done countless shows. Um, things that pop into my mind have been mixed dish, she's just not that into you. Um, to name a few, Ellen's been here as well. And we've done countless student films to try to help them through schooling process. They needed a location to shoot at and we've been there for them um, many, many times. So it's not only just big productions, but we also try to help as much as we can with, with small productions. Ah, groovy Magnolia Park. If entertainment is Burbank's backbone, then the eclectic small businesses like the ones here at Magnolia Park, are the heart. They supply television and film production crews with everything from food to clothes and plants. Tansy is a home decor plant shop. We sell items from all around the world as well as a variety of indoor plants as well as outdoor plants. We've also started renting out items for the studios as well. I actually like being on the other side. I like having the ability to, to help the set designers. You know, these shops that are on Magnolia, it creates an atmosphere within the community. People come here and they shop on Magnolia specifically. They want to go to those really odd, quirky shops that they're not going to find anywhere. I think it, it, I think it just helps everybody. As you've seen, Hollywood gets a ton of stuff from Burbank, which is great for us because it keeps our economy booming. 
But there's another thing that Burbank supplies Hollywood with. I'm talking about talent. We grow entertainers right here. People like Tim Burton, Blake Lively, Dove Cameron, and Ron Howard, all from Burbank. Sure, the studios do amazing work, but it all starts in our school system with teachers like Guy Myers. I am so lucky to get to do something that I love. Coming into this room every day, I get to laugh. I get to hear a student open up in a special way. I get to see kindness. I get to see kids supporting one another. Like you help each other out in an improv, that's the whole point. If someone's struggling with it, you help them, right? I think people want to be involved in inspiring the next generation. So when they see something good happening like we have here at John Burroughs High School, they want to be part of it. We've created great partnerships with Nickelodeon and Disney and Warner Brothers and Universal. Uh, and they uh, oftentimes will send wonderful people here to lead workshops or loan us stuff that we need for our shows. We get to go on and see uh, behind the scenes at the studios. So they're able to see real world applications of theaters and all the different kinds of jobs that are available to them here in Burbank. I have a lot of students who are in the tech industry here in Burbank and Hollywood. I have students who've been on Broadway and off-Broadway. We have students right now in Netflix shows and doing web series and commercials. They're, they're all over the place. No business like no business like no business I know. You get word before the show has started that your favorite uncle died at dawn. And top of that, your palm I have parted. You're broken hearted, but you go on. There's no people. It's been a heck of a journey. But the city council meeting is starting soon, and duty calls. From media giants to amazing teachers, Burbank, the media capital of the world, has it all, and then some. On behalf of the entire city council, thank you for helping make Burbank such a special place. Woohoo!